welcome to my kitchen. You saw me make the pressure cooker carnitas and in order to have a delicious dinner we're going to also make some really quick and easy Spanish rice or Mexican style rice. Two ingredients, you're going to love it. Let's see how we do it. super simple Mexican style rice and um, all this is is some of the frozen rice that I had in my freezer and I thawed it out a bit and a cup of your favorite salsa and maybe a little bit of water so what we're gonna do is we're just gonna mix this up and this is a personal choice if you don't like that much salsa then leave some out if you want more then put some more in there it's easy all the flavor is in there that you would get um, you know in, this is really like a salsa rice and that's good enough for me tonight because it's a weeknight and we're all getting ready to eat so we want a little bit of rice next to our burritos or in our burritos for that matter it'll be wonderful we're gonna put this on the stove and we're gonna heat it up and we'll be back when it's ready to go quick salsa rice is all finished it's heated through and yes, it is sticky, but that's because it's frozen rice and salsa. And I'm going to put this inside of some burritos anyway, so nobody is going to care. Okay? So this is also going to be great next to your tacos or in your tacos next to your burritos. You know, with your enchiladas, whatever you want. Throw some enchilada sauce on top of these. Everybody's going to love it. It's a quick and easy answer for a busy weeknight meal to throw on the side. If you have frozen rice in the freezer and salsa in the fridge, you have quick salsa rice. For dinner. So I hope you try this and I hope you love it and until next time I'll see ya. Thank you for joining me in my kitchen today. I hope you liked what you watched today and I hope that you try it and I hope that you love it. Um, if you like what you saw please consider hitting the thumbs up button and giving me a positive rating and also make sure that you hit the subscribe button if you're already not a subscriber so that you don't miss out on any of the fun we have here in our kitchen every single day. You can also follow me on Facebook and Twitter and Pinterest and Instagram and Google Plus and Blogger. I have a blog over there and you can take a look at that. You can um, subscribe to that feed as well. And don't forget that every recipe that you see me um, do here on YouTube, with the exception of a few earlier ones, you can access all of the recipes over on my website, NareenSKitchen.com, where you will find printer-friendly versions of those recipes so you can print them out and keep them for your own. So. I hope that you enjoyed it. I'm really glad that you're here. Thank you for stopping by. Don't forget to come by tomorrow. Until next time, happy eating!